I went to Don Quixote in Japan and they had this. So it says, Tanoshi Osushiya-san, and you can make sushi candy. The maguro, the tuna, is grape flavored. The ikura or salmon eggs is orange flavor, orange soda flavor. The egg is apple flavor and this, what is this? Chirashi. Chirashi sushi is a whole bunch of different fruits. So let's try it. There's instructions in the back, so I'll be going along and following this as I make the sushi candy. So let's open the box. Okay. And apparently you only need water and everything else is in this kit. So it comes in this cute packaging. Okay. And oh, the packaging. So you can cut it and then put the sushi on these plates. <laughs> okay, so let's see what's inside. We have rice. Uh, the tuna and the egg powder and the salmon eggs powder. We have some soy sauce and I don't know what this is. Oh, this is nori, the seaweed, and this little tubi thing. And a little spatula. Okay, so let's start. First, in the tray, we're going to make the rice and we put it in number one until the line uh we put the water up until the line and then add the powder in okay then add the powder oh it smells like sugar And apparently you have to mix it well. So this is what it looks like right now. And I'm gonna mix it. Oh. Ooh, okay, so it's getting harder and it's a little bit, it's getting harder and fluffy. Some of the powder got into the other sections, but okay, we'll have to make do. Okay. Hmm. Smells like soda or namune. Okay, so I think the rice is done. Looks like this. And step number two. Okay, we're gonna make the tamago, the rice. Okay, so this is the same concept. Put water until the line. Put water until the line and then add the powder in. So let's go. There's the tamago, tamago, tamago. Okay, so this is the egg and the maguro. So let's do the egg first. Oh, okay. Oh, I added too much water. Okay, I guess this is for getting the water to the perfect level. Okay, so let's add the powder. So I don't see these at the normal supermarkets. They used to sell them before, I think, because I remember coming to Japan when I was a, a kid, like in elementary school during my like summer vacation when I lived when I lived in the States and I saw this at the supermarket, but now they don't sell them at the supermarket anymore. So when I found it at Don Quixote, I had to buy it. It's so fun. Okay, so the egg is done. I think you have to let it sit so it takes shape. So the egg is done. And then for the maguro, the tuna, here we go. Oh. came to join me. 
He probably smells all the sugar. <laughs> oh, this one smells like grape. The tuna smells like grape. Okay, not real tuna, the, the candy. Yeah, it smells like grape. Okay, mix, mix, mix. Okay, this is what it looks like now. Okay, so I'm actually gonna cut it because the next step is making the seaweed and there's like a size guide on the packaging. Okay, I'm doing a very bad job at cutting, but. Okay. <laughs> Where did my nori go? Oh, okay, it's so small. Okay, okay here we go, let's open it. And you just roll it with your fingers, apparently. So, oh, stretchy. Okay. Oh, it smells like Coca-Cola. Okay, and this is my nori, my seaweed. Okay, next is making the ikura, the salmon eggs. Okay, so for the salmon eggs, I also put water to the line. And then I put the powder in. There's an A powder and the B powder, so I put them in the respective sections. So A goes in A. This is A, right? Yeah. A. And B goes in B. Okay, and then I mix, mix, mix. I got some in the egg. My egg is like orange now. Okay, and then for the ikura, I take this. Oh, and I get the orange part and put it, oh, and put it in A. Oh, okay, that, that one was really bad. Ah. No, it's so difficult. Okay, can you see? Ah, there we go. Okay. So. So I drop it in here. I drop it in here. And it's supposed to make these little balls, but it's, oh, really hard. Oh, I'm, I'm getting better at it. Oh, maybe it helps if I do it really quickly. Like, nope, that was bad. That was so bad. Oh, oh, I made a couple good ones. The ikura requires a lot of concentration. <laughs> It's really hard to make the little tiny balls. Oh, I'm getting better at it now. We'll see how good it turns out. It's like my mouth is open, like when I put on mascara and curl my lashes. It's when I'm like concentrating so hard. <laughs> okay, almost done. Okay, so now I'm done with everything. I have the egg, the maguro, the ikura here, and the rice. So for the size of the rice, this is the size. It's so small. And there's gonna be, let's see, one, two, three, four. Four different kinds. So let's divide the rice. Ooh, it's like fluffy. And yes, I messed up. There's like or <laughs> orange, orange on the rice. Divide it into four. No, don't eat it. Okay. Okay, here's one. Here's two. Here's three and four. Does this look like rice? Okay, and then 
We scoop the egg and the tuna, okay. Okay, so let's scoop the egg and the tuna. Oh, it's like moist. Ah, the egg ripped, no! Okay, I have to be more careful. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, Cooper, you can't eat this. Okay. Can you tell the egg has like marks? Then the maguro. Ooh, success, success. Okay. Okay, what else? The ikura. So I wrap this, this around the ikura. I mean, I wrap this around the rice. Oh, look at, okay. <gasps> this one is a total fit. Oh my God, it looks like, ugh, it looks like sperm. <laughs> okay, woo. Okay, these turned out good, okay. So put the pretty ones on top. Oh, oh. Okay, this one's ugly. We'll put some pretty ones on the ground as well. Okay, so that's that. And then the last one is, what's on the last one? Oh, the last one, you're just supposed to put everything on on top. Okay, that's why. That's why the egg is so big. That's why the, the tuna is so big compared to the rice. It's because the fourth one is a combination of everything. Okay, so I'll just cut and put everything on top. Ta-da! Mm. Put away the ugly pieces. And sushi is served! Let's see how I did. So it, it looks pretty good actually. Deki agari! This is what it looks like. I have the shrimp. Oh! Cooper, I have the shrimp, the egg, the chirashi, and the salmon eggs. Let's do a taste test. Okay, so let's do a taste test and see if it really tastes like what it says. So let's start with the maguro, the tuna. This is how it turned out. And it's supposed to taste like grape. Oh, and there's soy sauce. Totally forgot. It came with soy sauce. Uh, where did I put it? One sec. Okay, I'm back. I got the soy sauce. So let's make it. You just have to add water. Mix, 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 mix. Hi, Cooper. Okay. So this is the tuna. It's like real sushi because real sushi you eat with your hands. So this is supposed to taste like grape and the soy sauce is supposed to taste like soda. Mm. It's not good. Oh, it's not good at all. Yeah. It's not good, Cooper. So this is fun to make, but it doesn't taste good. The top tastes okay, this part, but the rice tastes really bad. And I don't like the texture. It's like squishy and a little hard. It's like a gummy, but yeah, it doesn't taste good. So 
yeah that was the the tuna i don't really want to eat the rest uh okay so i'm just gonna leave the rice because yeah i don't want to eat the rice but this is what the egg looks like the egg and it's supposed to taste like apple and actually when i was making it the powder smelled like apple so mm. okay this is pretty good it tastes like applesauce Okay, sweet applesauce. And then we have the ikura. Oh, we have the ikura. And you can see the little, the balls that were so hard to make. Oh, the texture is weird. It's not like the real ikura where it like pops in your mouth. It's kind of hard, these balls. And the seaweed color gets on your fingers. Oh. The seaweed is good. The rest is not so good. The seaweed portion is tastes like cola, cola gummies. And it has like a kind of like a gum texture. It's like swallowing Coca-Cola flavored gum. And then the chirashi, this is how it turned out. And this is just a combination of everything. And I didn't really like it, so I don't really want to eat it. <laughs> but that was that. It was really fun to make. So I think it would... Hi. I think it'll be fun if you had kids that could eat candy because it's fun to make and it's really sweet but it doesn't taste very good and they all kind of like taste the same <laughs> to be honest it tastes like a whole bunch of sugar but it's a fun little activity and I don't think you can find this in the states maybe it's only in Japan so that was the sushi box, the sushi candy box. But I also got, hold on. So yes, I went a little overboard and I also got the taiyaki and odango. And this is supposed to taste like, it doesn't say. Maybe it's supposed to taste like the normal sweets because taiyaki and dango are snacks, sweet snacks. And then I also got a hamburger set. Ooh, hamburger and french fries. And I also got the Tanoshi Omatsuri Yasan set. So this is like what they would sell at festivals. So there's like chocolate banana, corn, french fries, apple candy. Yeah. So let me know if I should try these. And by the way, I'm like reading the boxes and <laughs> it says it has calcium inside and it doesn't use real fruit juice. <laughs> so yeah, that was everything. And everything in here is 111 calories but it tastes like a whole bunch of sugar. Don't really recommend if you're going for a taste, but it's really fun. So that was that, and I'll make another video. Which one should I make next? I think I'll go with this one. This one looks the best. Yeah, I'll make this next. So I'll see you in the next video, and thank you for watching. Bye!